Hello PlayStation Nation, it's Mr. Allen C and we have a hot new paint job exclusive to my club for you here in a hot new car. We're in the Aston Martin today and we're headed to a brand new track. We're actually doing the Tapaka Run. This is in Chile. So load up your uh, car and get ready for a route. We are loading up the track right now. Get ready for a quick preview of the map. Look at that aerial view. Oh my goodness, this looks like a winding desert route track. Let me tell you, it took more than one attempt to beat this track with this car, but we will achieve the top three and have victory. We are racing once again with the Thrustmaster T80. Yes, you're going to want to race with this wheel. It is incredible. It's like you're actually driving the car. Uh, let me just emphasize, it is really hard to drive a car around a corner doing 117 miles per hour, or 130. But, um, looks like we manage here. Blue skies ahead of us. Uh, looks kind of like a desert setting, but once again, this is in Chile. Now, I do... Ooh, look at that. We've got a lot of cars behind us on our tail. We're going to keep the lead here. Looks like this corner's marked as green, so it should be safe. I'm just playing it safe. Uh, you know, I just want to, oh, uh oh, I've been taking it slow and I was getting the lead, but it looks like one bump in the road throws me off my trail. Alright, well let's see if we can work hard the rest of the race, play all the corners safe, and we're going to see playing the corners safe and slowing down for these corners, which seems like it would make us lose, we'll see if this actually makes us win, even though we're quite far behind right now. Does anyone else find it quite interesting that uh, this track it looks pretty vacant? Okay, now I'm seeing tents and stuff. But uh, I felt like we were in the desert there for a minute. I was going to ask why there's power lines out here, but I guess I see the crew. Well, there's a nice hood view for you. I'd like to show you a few different views, but check out that paint job on the car. It is incredible. I customized each of these with the colors, the design. And look at it on this car. I'm playing this track with a very difficult car. We're going to slow right down for these corners and do a great job. See if we can't get into the top three as needed. Oh, look at those tumbleweeds to the side there. But, um, yeah, I chose a really hard car to beat this track with. But the reason I did that was because I want my car to have the right look for my YouTube video. I thought you guys deserved to see the coolest car. And that's why I got the Aston Martin here. Look at me slow right down into that corner. Most guys would think that would make you lose, but it makes you win. It makes you win. And right now you're saying, oh, he's in eighth place. What's he talking about? Yeah, but once I got in eighth place, I got in my head, I need to slow down, take these corners slow, and I can pull off of it. I believe in myself. And uh, that's a little advice to you speed racers out there that are just slamming into the corner. I was just like you. But what I found is you need to take it slow on those corners. If they are yellow or red, you need to slow right down, maybe even come to a stop if necessary. And you need to work both that handbrake and that foot brake. Looks like we're catching back up with the pack here. It feels good to actually be back in the pack. Um, let me remind you, my favorite viewers like comment and subscribe we bring you the hottest cars the hottest tracks the hottest custom paint jobs join my club it's youtube stars you can get it featured in one of my videos just search the club and drive club youtube stars now it's spelled just like it sounds except for there is a space between the word youtube and stars back to the race here check out some of these other cars paint jobs pretty cool we have a yellow caution on this corner Breaks for this one? Wow, oh, up on the ledge here. That's kind of scary. I'm gonna flip you out of control if you do that. Alright, looks like we are approaching the end of the race. We're in third place, barely holding it together, flipping out of control, and we spin out across the finish line. At that point, I don't even care. I just need to get there, and we achieve third place, which, let me tell you, was near impossible in this Aston Martin on this track. This Aston Martin's awesome. It's good for a lot of things, drifting and different challenges. 
but for this track it was a challenge I had better options let me tell you but none of them looked as cool thanks for watching my favorite viewers like comment and subscribe